Lang Lloyd's Vital Nutrition Center here with you. Thank you for checking in on this video. Today what I want to talk to you about is what is inside your guts. So the idea for this video came from a book I was reading recently that was talking about healing gut issues and improving the amount of nutrition that a body can absorb and therefore put to use from its food. So I wanted to go over that idea and make sure that I explained it to you because it is a very, very important thing in terms of making sure that we all are well. So if we're going to go from point A to point B, it would go faster if we went in a straight line instead of in a curvy line. Now, if we're running late trying to get somewhere, it makes sense to take the straight line to get there. But if we were trying to maximize the journey, if we were trying to expand the trip, Right? If we're trying to slow ourselves down intentionally, taking more of the sights, we would take the curvy road. And this comes up inside of our digestive tract. So first, I want to make sure we understand that after we swallow food, it goes down into our stomach, and from our stomach, it feeds into our small intestines. That's the progression. Now, I want you to think about your stomach like the line to the slide. Have you ever been to a water park, maybe a playground, and the best slide there has a line to it? So you're standing in line and you're waiting for your turn. Now usually at something like a water park, and even most playgrounds nowadays, there might be a sign that says, remember, no pushing, no jumping, one person at a time, wait till the person in front of you is completely clear of the slide before you take your turn, right? There's info. That's the stomach. The stomach is setting things up, just like the rules for the slide is setting you up for a fun time on the slide. And then when we go to the small intestines, that's the actual slide. Now what happens in a lot of people's bodies is that the slide is too straight. So even if the stomach set everything up for the slide, you go down the slide too quick, the ride's over, and you didn't get the maximum effect or the full potential of the slide. What we want instead is that our intestines are more like a curved slide. Where we're spending more time going down the slide, we're actually covering a greater area, and we have time to take in the experience of the slide. So I want the food that you eat to have that full experience. I want it to take its time getting broken down so that we can absorb as much as possible from it. But if we throw our food down just a straight slide, there's not actually enough time for our body to absorb all the potential benefit of that food. That's true even if the stomach does its job perfectly. The stomach could function perfectly, but as soon as it drops the food into the small intestines, if that slide is too straight, it doesn't work as well as it could. So that's the problem that I want us to learn more about. We want a nice curvy slide when it comes to our intestines. In the next video, I'm going to tell you how we do it.